we're over at Culver 13, formerly Culver 13, it's now Culver Water Control Structure S271, and currently working in the uh, groin construction. Uh, Edens is the contract, the subcontractor doing the work, uh, hired by HBA, the Prime. And looking at straight ahead to the marine mattress that uh, is being delivered to the site, and basically there are planks of uh, stone material that are put together over at Lake Point Restoration, which is a quarry nearby, it's about a mile to two miles of, away from here. And you can see the geogrid uh, basically wrapped around the uh, stone with filter fabric on top to protect it from fines. So I wanted to show the device that they created to unload these marine mattresses. Looks like some kind of I-beam hanging, <clears throat> hanging on uh, from the crane, the mobile crane. And then uh, they've got these cylinders that go across and they get rigged to the ends of it and then lift it and will then be moved over and stockpile in there. So ahead you can see the marine mattress is sitting on the bottom of that pile of rock, sort of like a bed to stabilize a rock. From what I understand, uh, the, the marine mattresses, which are at elevation four inside the canal, uh, they haven't really seen a whole lot of organics or silt or anything like that, so it's a, it's a good product uh, and it's holding up. Also, one of the concerns that we had during this uh, construction is the movement of the groin sheet piles. And so far, at least there on the south, uh, there hasn't been a whole lot of